What's up YouTube, my name is Brian Marston and welcome back to the other reviews. Today in the other reviews, I'm reviewing all of the new Umbrella Academy figures I got. These were released a while ago, but because the Umbrella Academy Season 2 hadn't come out, I kind of lost interest in the show, but I really like the show. It's it's a good show. Um, if you haven't seen it yet, I can't really say anything because I don't want to spoil anything. But, um, but yeah, it's a really good show and I like it. So I'm going to go by order number, if you would. Uh, because um, uh, even though um, uh, original Hardgreaves, the, uh, the the father of all of them, if you will, he's a prick. So uh, he never named his kids, uh, so they named themselves somehow. It's kind of weird. So yeah, I'm just going to go off here. Not by number, I'm just going to go off by how I got them. So yeah, so first up I got Pop, Television, The Umbrella Academy, number 930, Allison, or number 3. And on the back here, the other ones you can get, I'm only doing this once since I have... Uh, three others here. Th 928, which is Luther. 929 is Diego. 930 is Allison. 931 is Klaus, who I want. That one's really hard to find. 932 is number five. 933 is Ben, who's also super hard to find. 934 is Vanya. 935 is Pogo. 936 is Cha Cha. And 937 is Hazel. Yeah. So um, I have Diego, Pogo, and number five here. So, yeah. So, uh, I'm, before I start opening these ones, I'm going to note out that on the back of all of these, it has what they say a lot. So, for Allison's, hers is, I heard a rumor, which is how she starts her power of getting people to do whatever the fuck she wants. So, uh, like, in season two, for instance, for one guy, uh, when she was evil Allison, she went, I heard a rumor that your head exploded and his head blew up. Uh, for another one, uh, uh, because they got dropped in the, uh, I'm just gonna spoil a little, spoil, uh, in season two, they got dropped in the 60s, uh, so segregation is still big in, uh, the states and parts of Canada and stuff, so they're in Dallas, Texas, uh, so this, uh, piece of shit cop starts beating up, um, Allison's, um, husband, and uh, she and he doesn't know that she has powers. And he, she goes, I heard a rumor that you just walked away. And he just walked away. So, yeah, no. So, yeah, I thought that was pretty cool. That was a good use of her power. And then later in the show, they question why she doesn't do it all the time. Because she can get super evil with it. Uh, like um, when they were getting attacked by these two Swedish, um, these hit hitmen. She goes, I heard a rumor that you killed your brother. Uh, you strangled your brother, and the hitman turns around and he strangles his brother until he's dead. So that's why she doesn't use her power all the time. Cause she could just be like, "I heard a rumor that you killed yourself," and then someone would die. So it's just how that one works. So yeah. And then next up, I got Diego, uh, or number two, and his says, "You were right. Life's too short." So yeah. And then I got uh, Pogo, and Pogo's says. One grows used to things, even if sometimes one shouldn't. And then number five is the best. His says, the kid wants coffee. Because that was his thing in season one. Because he's actually 58. But his consciousness is 58. But his physical form is 13. And he goes into a diner. And the lady thinks that uh, the truck driver that just walked in, uh, Diego, uh, uh, number five is his son. And she goes... And what would the kid want? And he goes, the kid wants coffee. So, yeah. So, anyways, I'm going to open all these boxes up and uh, let's get started. So, I have them all out of the box now. So, I'm going to start with Pogo because that was the first one I picked up. So, this is Pogo. Yes, he's an ape. Uh, he's a chimpanzee, actually, if I believe correctly. He's super old. He grows to be super old. And he's got little glasses, which is cute. Uh, the glasses here are kind of weird because they actually went to his face, not just on his... on where his nose is so yeah that's a little weird but yeah pogo's a badass character i love pogo uh and then here i got number five number five's holding a cup of coffee he's like the asshole of the group um he's a smart ass mostly because he knows more than everyone else and uh he's very paranoid and stuff he, he uh, that's why i love the character and he's wearing a schoolboy's clothing because that's all he had left to wear um then i got diego Diego's thing is that he can hold back objects. I think metal ones. I think he's like Magneto in that sort of way. So he could throw a knife and make that knife go. So let's say you're standing off to a corner and you're a bad guy. And he could throw a knife at a wall and make it turn and hit you. So that's kind of 
his power and he looks very very cool and then here's Allison. Allison's one is uh, ironic because she's holding the umbrella, Umbrella Academy. Uh, that one actually helps her stand up a little. She uh, stands pretty well. Uh, she got hoops, uh, he earrings. I never even noticed that before. But yeah, that's what uh, this is. Allison. So yeah, kind of short review, but honestly, I love this show and I can't wait till they make a season three. Season two was a cliffhanger. Not going to say any more, or I'll, I'll ruin it. So yeah, that's it for this episode. If you liked it, please leave a like, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.